Hi, and happy Friday. We're playing a game called April 24th tonight. I'm just gonna do a quick check of settings. Or I'm gonna have a jump scare on the loading screen. Good, we're off to a good start. But let's just start, shall we? Chapter One, The Wicked. Oh, well we start in what looks like a cell with a cross above the bed. That That's good, that's good. It is 7.05 p.m. Oh, they gave us a space heater, that's nice. And an ax, hmm, TV. Okay, so we're living in someone's basement. Great, great. Lots of paint. Oh, this is another game with a creepy teddy. Sorry, teddy. I'm gonna go finish wrapping up your nephew's gifts. Oh, absolutely, enjoy your wrapping. There's a ball. Okay, we got a ball. Um, why so many creepy teddies? I don't know. Well, I mean, this is, I think, the same people that made um, whatever that game was we played last week. Um, so I guess it makes sense that they do the creepy teddy thing. I don't know. So we have creepy teddies in the game and non-creepy teddies in the chat. I think it's a good balance. Oh, God. Well, hello to you, too, sir. I cannot open the door. Maybe we'll go back down. Well, you're looking very dapper, sir. May I help you? She shouldn't have done that in your bed. She deserves to be punished. Okay. Dear Ben, you've been living in the basement for months and haven't come out. You're going crazy and dragging us along. The kids and I don't understand what's going on with you. You've become aggressive and you're taking all your anger out on us. Alice is sick, it's hard for her to live in such an environment, and Jacob is still too young, and I don't want him to get hurt. Knowing that we have the right to live with you, I tried to discuss everything with you in a normal setting, but you don't make contact. I just want you to know that we have someone who will take care of all of us. All you have to do is let us go. Let us do this. Sincerely, Evelyn. Chapter 2, April 24th, 1991. <laughs> Okay, we have the axe. We, I'm guessing we went back in time because we're in a, uh, a, a video type setting. Hello, sir. The dapper gentleman is telling me I must go up the stairs. Hi, CT. How are you? Ooh. They're having spaghetti and meatballs for dinner. Yum. I'm doing okay. 
It was a nice productive day at work. No one was there, so I got a lot of stuff done. So that's always nice. Oh, Dapper Gentleman wants me to go upstairs again. He says, do it. I don't know his name, so he's just going to be the Dapper Gentleman. Because that seems appropriate. I cannot go into that room. It's way up the stairs, right? Alright, there's a, a baby. Okay, there's a wheelchair in that room. Somebody's whispering in my ears. I <laughs> Hello, Ari. Welcome in. You haven't missed much. Um, I got jump scared on the loading screen and within like a minute of loading the game. So, you know, all par for the course. <laughs> and this dapper gentleman uh, keeps pointing at where he wants us to go. we opening so slowly? Oh, now we're loading. My name is Sean Miller. I'm conducting a journalistic investigation of a brutal murder on the outskirts of the city that occurred on April 24th. I want to find out the true cause of this crime and find answers to all questions. Chapter 3, The Observer. <sighs> we're like five minutes into the game and we're only on chapter 3. Dapper gentleman. <laughs> I mean, okay. <laughs> Hi, Raynar. How are you? <laughs> you don't know why he has a New York accent, but you'll just go with it. Okay. Through the Dawa. I think that sounded more Boston, but you know, I get what you're going with. Thank you. Okay, what do you want me to do, game? I think that was a blurb. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. She... Well, then you're just a demon. Oh, I forgot to mention your adorable AF, yes. You wouldn't have Steam friends because you just send them all the good life? Is that what it is? Alright, seriously. <laughs> all the good the There's addition of deadly premonition. I love it. Alright, it started us here. In <sighs> 
in front of the VCR and TV. But I cannot click it. Oh! There's a handprint on the drawer. I should probably open the drawer that has a handprint on it. You are trolling today. That's okay. You troll away. On April 24th, a brutal mur murder took place in the house on the outskirts of the city. A man killed his entire family with an axe. The accused himself called the police and was arrested on the spot. The man testifies and says that he was influenced by a certain man in a hat, the dapper gentleman. Thank you for that. And that he forced him to commit this crime. The police have no further comment. We will monitor the developments in the case. Okay. Oh, now I see a handprint over here. Pieces of meat. I shall play the tape. Movie time! I don't know, is it literal pieces? We shall find out. But this is chapter four, Pieces of Me. All right, the door is tied shut with a uh, rope. Good, good, good. We're off to a good start. I mean, we did hack our family apart with an, with an ax, so it might be the pieces. There's a skull and a hammer outside this bloody door. That's cute. Need to look for a knife. Okay, we need a knife. Oh! There's creepy teddy and creepy baby. I think I'm more disturbed. Yeah, I'm more disturbed by the creepy baby. Oh yeah, Ari, you missed the creepy baby on the loading screen, so you're welcome. Oh, it's a knife. Get out of here. I don't know if that was the game or a blurb. I really have no idea. Hundred percent the game. Okay. <laughs> okay, that one was a blurb. <laughs> doesn't can if they don't find the body. <laughs> You're right, it doesn't. <laughs> okay, now I need a lock. Or a key for the lock. on the floor now. Why did we go in that room? He's laughing. It's scary. It was. That's a good point there, Ari. Do your kid does your kids' laughter scare you? What am I looking for in here?
you were afraid of the screaming children at Walmart, scared they'll never leave and stop and stop or stop screaming. And that is fair. Okay, the name of this book is Man and His Woman. Also followed by Time to Die and Battle Until Death. These books have a theme. They're just tall enough for their eyes to be eye level with you when you lay down bed. It's fucking terrifying. Yeah. Oh, that's how tall Evan is? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Can I go back downstairs? Yes. That is nephew. Sure he moved. Most tiny humans don't have uh, respect for personal space. Aries are soon to not be so tiny humans. Alright, it lets me in this room, but why? on fire? I mean, I'm trying. I'm, yeah, I'm just holding an open flame next to everything. Come in! Hi, scent. I mean, I'm holding a lighter next to flammable liquids, so... I am stumped. Toastful tea on yourself and your keyboard. Oh, no. Oh! Hand print? No. CT so went and saw a movie you were interested in? What movie is this? I mean, I saw him say it in your chat earlier, but I don't remember. Okay, you worked, worked out, baked desserts, clean dishes, wrapped gifts, and you're finally done. You can just relax. Enjoy, Teddy. Your creepy version is downstairs on the couch with, with the creepy baby. You can join him if you'd like. For those who don't know, there is a new Mad Max movie based on a character from Furry Road. Ah. Are you sure those laundry detergent soaps are flammable? I mean, maybe. If so, you lied about, was lied to about mine because you tried letting it on fire. Uh, I mean, they might not be. I just assume. Yeah, good work, Teddy. Yeah, Furiosa was it was good. Oh nice, nice, nice. Hey. They want in there. Mad Max Furry Road was a movie so awesome. There's a recurring unnamed character who played thrash metal on guitar and that was also a flamethrower. Oh nice. You don't know how you improve on that design. game. I need 
some direction. quite the direction I was looking for. So you know how you don't care for some of the stra direction Stranger Things has gone, you'll still watch the finale because you get a character playing Master of Puppets in another dimension under red sky filled with lighting. You don't know how you outcool that for an 80s thing, right? I have not watched Stranger Things yet. Probably should. You spoiled this. I mean, that's fine. <laughs> Whatever I need to do is upstairs. But I don't know where and I don't know what. Like, I clearly need to get into that room, but I don't have a way to. sure what you want from me, game. Where's my dapper gentleman when I need him? There's a crowbar right there. safe in the kitchen. Okay. Oh, 
there's a coffin on the table. Because of course there is. It's clearly been here for some time because um, there's flies. That was creepy. Showing me a shelf with rope and a hammer and nails on it. I <gasps> watching you. Okay. Okay, lady. Why? Now she's in. Tie the ropes to the doors. Okay. <laughs> Close the. and board up the coffin. Find a cross and put it on the coffin. Um, cross, please. Okay, that book next to the middle of the bookshelf is red. I pull the book. <laughs> you stay right there. I'm gonna go uh, put a cross on your mother's coffin.
Chapter 5, The Touch of Evil. <sighs> <laughs> she was coming after me. Oh, now we're all boarded up in here. Okay. Oh, that's the same thing we read earlier. Okay. Need to lock the door with a chair. Oh. <laughs> oh. Now I got creepy baby over here. Proof of death. Uh, baby says we need to watch proof of death. Chapter 6, Proof of Death. Oh. Yeah, they dead. I've seen the proof. We can go. Oh, there's a rat ch Oh, 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 okay. used condom on the dresser. Duh. Duh. Like they were doing the horizontal tango and then somebody murdered them. I mean, that's how I'm uh, understanding this. Oh, we're locked in here with the chain. Good, good, good. We got saw. I'll take that, thank you. Fine, let me get out of here. Oh, baby. I'm seeing do not enter. Well, of course I'm going to enter. I can open this door with a bolt cutter. And not the saw I just had in my hand like two seconds ago. That's a 3C. Right, are there other numbers places?
don't have to go back in the death room. Thank you for that. like I need a fourth number. Dear Ben, I can't live like this anymore. I want to get a divorce and sell the house. My torment has become unbearable and I need freedom. Please give me the opportunity to start a new chapter in my life. Sincerely, Evelyn. You're awake. What did you miss? Napalm? I can get napalm? <laughs> Sadly, we cannot get napalm. Sorry. Uh, you missed a really disturbing proof of death. Mm -hmm. That's what... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hi, buddy. I'm going to take that key, okay? Thank you. You are very helpful. <coughs> oh, ow, oh, ow, oh, ow, oh, ow. Oh. We got another another crime scene. I do play the weirdest games. Oh, oh, it's in her uh, where oh, where her head should be there's a rat. And, oh, wait. Uh, okay. the door. I need something to open it with. Okay. Oh, look. There's the, uh, bolt cutters. Jump scares there. 
Coco loves rats. Uh huh. Oh, they so normally they don't bother me, but the, the eating of the the corpses is just ah. Uh -huh. Yes, madam. Oh, it's a murder <laughs> weapon. Who am I murderer ring? ring? My displeasure over chainsaws pleasure it makes you happy. I'm glad. Dapper Gentleman is back. Hello, Dapper Gentleman. Oh, you're making me watch the video? Okay. Chapter 7. There is no way out. Dapper gentlemen, hi. There's a tape, which I'm sure it wants me to grab. There is no way out. It's your turn to make a movie. Well, all right. Baby is pointing here. Okay, there's a crowbar. A rope. Oh, I see. I think we're about to become a hanging body. <laughs> That's what I think.
Oh, oh well. Finish your movie. Um, Dapper gentleman would like me to hang myself. Who am I to refuse? I have complete, completed this investigation, but unfortunately I will not be able to publish it. This house is a source of madness, and it has consumed me. I wanted to find the truth, but instead I found death. It's all about the man in the hat. He oppresses his victims and makes them do terrible things. Ben recorded everything on tapes. I saw that man forcing Ben to kill his wife for cheating, but it wasn't enough for him. He continued to stalk him until Ben killed his entire family. Now I'm his next victim, and I can't stand up to him. Sean Miller. Okay. I mean, clearly you want me to... Oh, there we go. Okay, here we go. Yes. I mean, the game loading screen told me it would take 40 minutes, so we went a little longer than that, but that's okay. Yes, we're going to do on to RE4 Remake. Oh! We're in a coffin with Creepy Baby, and there's a rat at my foot. sure that uh, ghost was creeping me out in Russian. But, you know, whatever. <laughs> oh. oh yeah, here's a creepy loading screen for anybody that missed it earlier. You're welcome. Um, but actually, I really, I, I, this game was good. I, I liked it. It was, it was, it was a good one. Uh, but thanks for being here. I appreciate it. Have a good night.